All right, today I'm taking a look at Caribou Crossing. This is barrel 167. This is Big Red Liquor single barrel. And uh, the thing I love about Caribou Crossing is its playfulness. You know, it's it's a play on words of Buffalo Trace. It's made by Sazerac. They put this moose on top. It's a little bit silly. It's a lot of marketing. Um, the, the facts are these. We don't know which distillery it comes from. It's bottled at 80 proof. It is a single barrel. Um, there's no age statement on it. It has to at least be three years old to be a Canadian whiskey. So that's kind of the starting point. Lots of marketing, not a lot of facts, but I think the reason people like it is it's kind of geared towards bourbon heads buying this for the collectability of it. But then when they taste it, it's their exposure to Canadian whiskey for the first time and the subtleties and the pleasures of Canadian whiskey, which is an overlooked category and it's delicious. So let's dig into barrel 167. So Typical nose, toffee, um, there's a little bit of that fresh cut oak. There's kind of a vanilla bean ice cream component going on here and a lot of butterscotch. On the palate, it's light, it's sweet. It's got creamy vanilla. The complexity builds through the mid palate. There's that touch of citrus there, a little bit of creme brulee and a touch of spice to finish. I love this barrel. And despite the silliness of the brand to some extent, um, it's producing great whiskey. Cheers.